Okay, good. We're buying troll skibbies. Why is that, you may wonder? Well, oh, I guess that kind of answers the question of why that wind did so little damage before. But, um... We're about to enter an area of the game that is very heavily populated with hellhounds. And hellhounds may not be the big threat they were in the original, but among them are uh, a bunch of Cerberuses, formerly lava hounds. And having the troll skivvies to reduce the damage from their fireballs is going to be very nice. Don't want to mess with the hounds, no sir. Let's go get them. Rawr. Oh, Lunar Eclipse, you. Wow, that was a ton of damage. I wonder if that's a magic crit. It can be hard to tell whenever you do that much damage. Usually big numbers like that do indicate a magic crit. I'm like looking at the time of day and thinking about Brenna's stats. I don't think her numbers would be that high normally. Like you'd have to you'd have to cast light to get that kind of result normally. She really wrecked them. Wow. But I'm still gonna try and scare them away. Yep. Go away, hellhounds. <sighs> One down. Two down. So I'm gonna smack this one and make it three. Yes. Shall I? We'll run you over here because there's gonna be more. Same with Alaron. Not that he can't hit the entire battlefield with Aura of Death anyway. Yes, that one's gone. Okay. Yeah. Seeing that kind of damage, it's a wonder they survived her assault before. Shop. Now leave. Yes, yes. La dee dee. That one's fleeing. Anyone else? Please. Do you think hellhounds can get fleas? I don't think they can. <laughs> and I think the fleas can handle that. Did this one attack? Did you actually attack me? Hey! Run away, nerd. Respect my forehead. He's going. Going, 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 going. Oh my god, he's still didn't reach it. Go on, go on, go on. Yes, goodbye. Victory. We got the sulfur. Sulfur is actually an item in the original game. I corrected its spelling. It used to have a PH when it's supposed to be an F. But. Yeah, it was always there. I mean, it's not something you can find normally. Yeah, but it existed. I'm pretty sure trying to examine it causes the game to freeze. And I'm also pretty sure it was intended to be a reagent before it was, like, scrapped for whatever reason. There are several items like it. A handful of the items that I created as just cell items um, were closer to the... Oh, what's it? It's like the reagent array than anything else. It's kind of hard to describe, I guess, because they all have the same item code. Like, uh, items of the same type have the same code. Like, um, for example, weapons all have the precursor 7 in their code, and armors are all 5s, shields are all 6s, and key items are all 1s. And I guess these are items just that just don't serve any other purpose besides rotting in your inventory. Like, obviously reagents have some purpose to them. Uh, like, you can use them for casting spells, but you can't use them for anything else. 
Uh, but among the expansion items, there was like a huge list of key items that were unused. And there were a, a handful of uh, key items that were a separate array that seemed like they were meant to be reagents. So I took those four and made them into things that you would get like a handful of in the fights they were relevant for. And Sulfur was one of those. So there's, there's Sulfur. It's also true of the Bone Fragments. Oh, uh, what else? The Feather Down that you get from Griffins and Harpies. The Shed Skin you get from just about any Reptile. Uh, what was that all for? No. Bone Fragment, Shed Skin, Feather Down. Uh, oh yeah. The sulfur, and the final one is Mystic Dust. Which I think you can only get off Dust Devils now. I wanted to give it to more enemies, but I just had too many items to distribute, and it just didn't happen. Who would have thought I'd have too many items to put on the drop charts in a game with, like, 400 inventory items? Hmm. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Don't even, don't even bother running over there. Alright, this one. Eh. Now flee. Eh. That one's running. That one's attacking for some reason. Hey now. I'll stand Brenna here so it'll run away quicker. But this one really wants to fight her. It just wanted to show off that Hellhound bite animation one more time before the playthrough ends. It knows there won't be too many chances to show it off anymore. Yeah, we got the Dragon Flame Scroll. Although it's a little bit nonsensical, I decided that most of the fire scrolls and such should be dropped by Hellhounds. There's a sapphire gem in that pile. Dang. Alright. Uh... So yeah. Even further to the side of... Freaking the Valley of Maxon and the mini valley next to Maxon, there's this big empty space! Or we can find some salamanders. But that's not all that's out here. Lunar Eclipse the salamanders, please. Oh, you're failing. It's getting too late. Yeah. The more of this I'm seeing, the more clear it was that that was definitely a magic crit that Brenna got. Eh. I'm casting darkness. Just to make the salamanders sad. It doesn't benefit anyone on the field, but, but Sholei. <laughs> There's no reason for her to cast that. But it does hinder these guys a bit. Whenever I do get around to my challenge run for this, I think I'm probably going to have to use Darkness against Salamanders. Because they... they are the ones with Dragon Flames now, and they are scary. They're the new Hellhounds, basically. Which means they're mean. It'll be interesting to see how more, how dangerous they are compared to Hellhounds. Stop it. No. See, now imagine what- ow! They actually got a 21 out of us, even though the darkness has been cast. That's kind of intense. Did I actually cast Aura of Death on any of you? Oh, other one kind of failed. We'll try again. There we go, now they're running away. Yes. Flee, Salamander, flee. God, they're so weirdly large. I mean, they're hitboxes. You can get locked into combat then, even when it seems like you shouldn't. Uh, over here we've got a backup salamander. Get him! Dragon Fang. That's doing elemental damage now, I th think. Used to be Star. But nothing was really weak to Star that I'm aware of. 
How about I just start hacking you to pieces, lizard? Eh. Run out, run over here. Is this guy fighting? Or is he gonna run? He hasn't really gotten a turn yet, huh? Not a, not since, like, I cast it on him. Oops. I was trying to attack the other one, but the stick flicks back. Oh, yeah, he's fighting. Ow! He bit Donovan's face off. Awesome. Chop him. There we go. One dead salamander. Fight back! I, there, Donovan. Yeah, you did it. Okay, one more to go. Over there, is he? Mm -hmm. What are you doing all the way over here, Salamander? Uh, make me walk. You can do it, guys. Yeah. Donovan, leveled up. His stats are all good. Uh. Uh, okay, that's one more, nine, ten, four, ten. You're our pole, man. Keep using your pole to the best of your ability. Uh... Teleportation... Might want versus star. Oh. Uh, yeah, see, there's some shed skin and sulfur. Let's see... Uh... This a big old empty valley. It's like you escape the shitty bits, and then there's just open plains again, with some gently rolling hills. Is there anything over here? I don't think so. This is another one of those spots of the desert where it seems like there should be something, and there's just not. Oh, there's another salamander. Hey there, guy. I don't know why. You had so much trouble initiating that combat with me, sir. Uh, what are the chances of Brenna getting a second turn before they do? Now they're going to be casting Dragon Flames at maximum ferocity, which is kind of terrifying. We'll, we'll, we'll give them a chance. We'll see just what these salamanders are capable of. And by give them a chance, I mean that's if I don't scare them all off first. Because I'm definitely going to try. These enemies are so unremarkable in the original. They're it's kind of easy to forget they exist. And I forget just how many of them there really are. They show up a lot in the desert. They think out that one little patch up to the north of Ugarit. And then there's more of them up here over here, obviously, that we've been killing. Yeah. It's like. Meh. Feels like they could afford to be a little healthier. I'm gonna stab this one. There he goes. That wasn't super great. But it is being reduced by our troll skibbies. So that's something. Hey there, guy. Yeah, I can imagine that number would actually be quite scary if I did not have elemental resistance on. And if they were all casting it, like, holy ball. It really would be hellhounds all over again. Incidentally, that lizard scale armor we keep finding uh, is basically the late game equivalent to Hellhound Hide now. Like, you can still get Hellhound Hide, but its protection is not very good. You'd only be wearing it for the fire resistance, really. And now that lizard scale exists, well, you would just wear the lizard scale instead. Do I have any Hellhound Hide I can compare it to to show you the difference? So much junk. We have the Hellhound Eye? No, we don't. I don't think I can even craft any. Yeah. Oh no, we have a Hellhound Belt. Who wants to make some Hellhound Eye? Oops. You do! Yeah, see, I'll show you the comparison. Yeah, this is like the default 
uh, bonuses of Hellhound Hide, the original game. And here's the lizard scale I made. Same fire resistance, same dexterity penalty, but twice as much protection, and a little less stealth. That's actually a little different in the new version. I don't remember exactly how much I changed them, but Hellhound Pelt no longer protects against fire quite as much, since it also shows up way earlier in the game now. And I think I took away its dexterity penalty. It's either reduced or gone, I can't remember. Not a big deal. Um, there's just so much space over here. Ah, another hellhound. There are a lot of these things. Yeah, I wanted to teleport right up in their grills. Pardon me. I don't know if you could hear that, Bert, but pardon me anyway. Cast light. Yay. Uh, get over there, Alaron. Scare them. Okay. Stand, er, no, I don't need to stand next to these ones. They can run away on their own. <laughs> run Sholay over here. She'll be ready for the reinforcements. Who do you think the leader is, Donovan? This one? Usually is. That one ran. Oh, he's beginning an action, but he didn't attack. Curious. We'll never know, because I'm going to kill him. We'll only be sure if this one doesn't run. Ah, yep, it was the leader, see? It was the leader. It's fine. Oh no, more hellhounds. Chop. Let's get him. Me. Soft lips are more likely to flee. Morale is definitely tied to HP sometimes. This I know for sure. Hey, he's casting immolation. They burned my friends! Now it looks like they're trying to leave. You know, it might just be faster to kill you. Hellhounds are kind of freaky, I gotta admit. They've got that lava ridge in their backs and stuff. And the whole two-headed thing. Uh, they're kind of strange to look at. Let's see. Uh, not gonna cross past those rocks. Because back over this way is closer to where Maxon is, yeah. Okay. There might be another encounter out in the valley, but we'll take care of this a little bit first. As you can see, the train noticeably changes to something more man-made. And you heard that whistle in the air, right? That... That was like the worst whistle imitation ever. But over here... There's a secret grotto. And more hellhounds guarding it. Aw oh, man, I need to camp or cast light or something. Aleron's failing all over himself. Aura of death resisted the spell. Aura of death. I got two of them. I'm not bored, I swear. Shall I get over there? Brenna. Cast light, please. Hooray. Oh, they're burning us. 
You know what, guy? Just for that, you got a throwing iron to the face. I call it a throwing iron, even though it's a dragon fang. I oh, know, I'm just too used to it. Oh, let's try that again. Get the other two. Scare him. Scare him good. Yes. Eh. Fleeing. 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 Gosh, I wonder who the leader is. Hmm. Let's go again. Yo, fun fact about the leader. In any given battle, there is absolutely only one entity that is the leader. And I learned this whenever I recently made it so that you can cast Sense Aura on your friends. When I had Alaron cast Sense Aura on himself, it listed him as a follower. <laughs> so if Alaron isn't the leader of the heroes, then I guess no one is.